On January 1st, 1863, in the middle of the Civil War, the Emancipation Proclamation was issued by US President Abraham Lincoln. It granted freedom to all persons held as slaves in 10 Confederate-controlled states. However, for the most part, the order was not enforced until Union soldiers were able to advance into these areas after the end of the war, the beginning of which came in April 1865 with the surrender of Confederate General Robert E. Lee after the Battle of Appomattox Courthouse in Virginia. On June 19, 1865, U.S. Major General Gordon Granger delivered to the people of Galveston, Texas, General Order No. 3, which read, in part, Executive of the United States, all slaves are free. This involves an absolute equality of personal rights and rights of property between former masters and slaves. And the connection heretofore existing between them becomes that between employer and hired labor. This day soon became known as Juneteenth, a verbal shorthand for June 19th. Slavery in the United States would be formally abolished with the ratification of the 13th Amendment on December 6, 1865.